Greetings everyone, this is Jim Todd with Song Surgeon and in this weekly video tip we are going to cover the topic of high resolution monitors. I'm going to show you some ways in which if you have a high resolution monitor and you need to adjust Song Surgeon to better fit, to better display on your monitor, how you can go about that. So there are a couple of things you can do. Firstly, within the program itself, and this applies to both Mac as well as Windows users, if you go to the Options button, in the tabs here you'll see GUI resizing, and if you go there, you should see a default setting of 1. 1 is the normal size. And then if you select this drop-down list, you'll see numbers that are smaller than 1. In my case, it goes down to 0.75, and larger than 1, it goes to 1.24. So a number larger than one will make everything larger on your screen and a number smaller will make everything smaller. So let's just, for example, choose 1.16. Click the OK button. You can see behind this window that it is enlarged and if you want to keep that size, then you need to click the OK button down here at the bottom of the window a second time. So that's the first thing you can do, and this works on both Windows as well as Mac machines. So I'm going to go back and just change this back to 1 again. So this next thing applies to Windows only, and when we're done with this, then we'll talk about Mac. So on Windows, if you go down here to Windows Explorer, and you go to the Song Surgeon Program Files folder, so it's in the C drive, it's under Program Files x86, go to Song Surgeon, Song Surgeon 5, there it is. Open this Program Files folder, this will be your path on your machine, and find the main executable, the main exe, which is Song Surgeon 5.exe. Right click it, go to Properties, once properties open, go to compatibility, go to this tab here, and in this tab you'll see this little option here which is change high DPI settings. If you select that, down here at the bottom you'll find high DPI scaling override. Select that, and that will then enable this box below it, and this drop down box then if you open it will say application, System and System Enhance. Choose System. Select OK. Select Apply. Select OK. And now, when we open the program, it essentially opens it as if you had a lower resolution monitor. Therefore, everything will appear bigger on the screen, as you can see here on my screen. So the next thing I want to briefly cover then is what you can do in a Mac. So you have the GUI resizing settings, which we showed you, which apply to both Windows and Mac. Okay, so on your Mac, if you go to your system preferences, and in your system preferences, you select display. Once you've done that, then you'll open a menu that looks like this. And it will probably be set to default for display. If you then select Scaled, you'll see some other options appear. Now, every machine is probably going to be different, but the point is you'll see some options and your default setting, in my case, it's 1080p is selected. So if you choose something that's smaller than that, like 720p, that means that everything on your screen, screen will actually get larger. If you have a situation where the display is too big and you like to make it smaller, then select a resolution that's higher than this default setting. So you'll have several options within your Mac. You can try one. If you don't like it, you can go back and you can try a second and you can experiment until you find something that works. So on Windows, you have a couple of options and on Mac, you have a couple of options. And so with that, we'll conclude this weekly video tip on how to deal with high-resolution monitors. Thanks for watching.